this is the night mail crossing the border, bringing the check and the postal order, letters for the rich, letters for the poor, the shop at the corner of the girl next door, pulling up B took a steady climb, the gradients against her but she's on time. cotton grass and moorland boulder, shoveling white steam over her shoulder, snorting noisily as she passes, silent miles of wind-bent grasses, birds turn their heads as she approaches, stare from the bushes at her blank-faced coaches, sheepdogs cannot turn her course, they slumber on with paws across, in the farm she passes, no one wakes but a jug in a bedroom gently shakes. Freshened. The climb is done. Down towards Glasgow she descends. Towards the steam tugs yelping down the glade of cranes. All Scotland waits for her. In the dark glens, beside the pale green sea lochs, men long for news. Letters of thanks, letters from banks, letters of joy from the girl and the boy. Receipted bills and invitations to inspect new stock or to visit relations and applications for situations and timid lovers' declarations and gossip, gossip from all the nations. New circumstantial news, financial letters with holiday snaps to enlarge in letters with faces scrawled in the margin. Letters from uncles, cousins and aunts. Letters to Scotland from the south of France. Letters of condolence to highlands and lowlands. Notes from overseas to Hebrides. Written on paper of every hue with the pink, the violet, the white and the blue. The chatty, the catty, the boring, adoring, the cold and the fish. All the hearts are pouring. Clever, stupid, short and long. The type and the printing and spelled all wrong. Thank you.